Good morning, Seekers. I'm glad you found us today. We are having our first day of homeschool today, and I am heading out to Walmart this morning because we just got paid, and I wanted to buy the kids something special for breakfast this morning to surprise them and get them kind of like excited and going for the day. With regards to the channel, we wanted to announce that we are going to be switching to a little bit different schedule, a little bit different format. During the summer, we decided we would try and do dailies because um, we had more time and we were doing more things and, and stuff like that. But during the school year, we've decided that dailies are just not going to work for our family. And so we're probably going to be doing a five day a week schedule for videos. Now we may, may sometimes do seven, um, depending on what goes on in our lives, if we have extra footage. But for the most part, we will be taking a couple of days off. I am not sure which days those will be. We won't be have like a regular day off kind of thing. It'll just be um, two days a week. We just won't post something probably. So I hope that works for you guys. I hate to disappoint you, but you're all going to be busier doing your homework and keeping up with school and everything now that school is starting. So um, I'm sure you, like me, also do not have as much time as you had on your hands during the summer months. So I hope that'll work for both of us. So I'm going to head to Walmart and get my shopping done and then come home and get these kids going on their day. There's some fruit in there too. All ready for our uh, yeah. first day of homeschool feast? Yeah. yeah! All right, we are gonna have a prayer and then we will dig in. Yeah! Mmm, does that taste good, buddy? Mmm, mm, strawberries and sausage. Virginia, what do you? How do you feel about the unicorn cereal? Um, well, it kind of tastes like Play-Doh. Like Play-Doh? Like actual Play-Doh? Gross. And Phineas, what is your review of the, uh, what is this? Cold Stone Birthday Cake Remix cereal with marshmallows. It's definitely not ice cream. It's definitely not ice cream. Does it taste good? It tastes okay. It's like Lucky Charms, but worse. But worse? <laughs> I like sausage and bacon are better. I do too. Yeah. I'm gonna try Mom, this. That's good to hear. Yogurt, you never let me have yogurt. Yeah, I usually don't let her have any of my Greek yogurt. So how do you feel about that yogurt mixed with Mio? This is what we put in our yogurt. You might want some more Mio. Is it sweet enough? Do you need more? Oh. Shoot. <laughs> Did you use a whole squirt? Probably not. Look at that. It's cold. Cereal doesn't taste good, but it's good for coloring. <laughs> yes. That's an expensive draw, coloring page. Hey, welcome everybody to our first day of homeschool. We just finished our homeschool first day of homeschool feast. We've done our 15 minute cleanup. So what we what we do in the mornings is to have a devotional first, where we start with our scripture reading and a prayer. Um, we usually do the Pledge of Allegiance, and we read a family book together. So it's whatever story we decide we're going to start reading together. Um, and then we'll do either history or geography or science. We'll kind of, we kind of rotate through as we decide we want to, to do. And then we split off. This year I'm really trying to help my older ones to fill in gaps and figure out where they're lacking and things like that. And so I am actually going to start oldest to youngest work with them one-on-one, -on -one, get them started on their things that they need to do. Hopefully, we'll make it through everyone. Now, the toddler is going to be kept busy. Of course, my new kindergartner, Ruby, she has an online program, so that makes that easy. We're gonna get started with that. I'm probably not gonna show a lot of it. Got a lot of students, and I just have to make sure we get the basics done because we kind of do a performing arts type of school here in our home school because we spend every day at the dance studio. So we try and get as much basics done as we can before we head out there. And that's kind of where we at with homeschool. And we're excited about a new homeschool year. This year is bound to be really awesome and really fun. And tomorrow, we're having our first not back to school day celebration. So tune in for, for that. You're not gonna wanna miss it. All right, so when we are doing our history and when we're doing our reading time, our group reading time, we basically can put out all of the art supplies and the kids can draw as they would like to or write as they would like to. 
while we do this. Oliver apparently is going to be sharpening his knife. Hopefully it won't be too noisy. So our only rule is that you can't make a lot of noise and you can't have electronics at the table. Yep, that's right. Yeah, Jasper's got big crayons, huh, Jasper? Show us those. No Yeah. No, it's an eye. It's an eye. Sure. Jasper, your pants are falling down again. Tie them. That will help. That won't help. They don't have an elastic tie thing. You have to pull them up on your hips. <laughs> what on earth are you doing, son? You're making an octopus and then no, killing it? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. That's okay. Oh. And then what do you do with an octopus? You can what? Jump on it? You can drump it? <laughs> well, at least you're using your imagination. <laughs> you're so cute. Which one says t There you go. Jasper, you're loud. Crazy man. Don't hurt Finny. Yeah, those are someone else's glasses. I'm sure it's making it so easy to see everything. This girl is starting high school tomorrow. It is her first day. I thought I can't just send her off to high school without buying her at least a few pieces of clothing to add to her awesome wardrobe that she already has. This guy back here, he likes clothes and he's always whining because I never take him shopping. So we're actually going to Uptown Cheapskate, which is savers at another level. They have like more like teenager brands, higher level clothing and I have to be careful not to look because I am now small enough to fit in the clothes. Let's go shop. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, work it girl. Dude, like you're wearing a t-shirt and shorts. I thought we were I thought we were in the GQ. Oh look the wall though. It was all GQ on the wall there. Oh yes. Oh yes. Gray t-shirt. You look hot. <laughs> what size is it? A medium? I mean, they are kind of baggy, but you could roll them. But I think it's cute how they bag around the ankles. It reminds me of 80s outfit with the with the uh, leg warmers and the big warm-up top. You know what I mean? I like the top. I know it feels really big, but look at the length on the sleeves and how it kind of bags right here. And I liked how it bagged and bagged, like it matched. It kind of has its own little twinsy thing going on. I like those pants way better than the first pants. Like so much more. Those are freaking adorable. And that top is freaking awesome. Like heck yes. Turn around like do a 360 here. Yeah. I like it. I think you should get that. But oh, dang it boy. That looks good. Those pants look so good. I'm so glad I made you try them on. Look at that. See? Dang. Yeah we have to get that. Hey Finn, how was class?
the day is finally over, Ruby. Mm-hmm. It's about time to hit, hit the bed eh, and go to sleep, dear. Did you have a fun first day of school? You ready to do not back to school day tomorrow? All right, what do you say to the Seekers? Bye, Seekers. Find us later.